Good afternoon, my hatters. So today I want to start this thing um, with why the red pill is failing. I'm gonna get right into it because I don't have any extra cool stuff to add on to the video or stuff like that. And I'm pretty much gonna raw dog this one, right? I'm not gonna do too much editing because I don't feel like doing editing. So it's gonna look like a bag of ass. It's gonna sound like a bag of ass, so bear with me. So today I want to talk about part one of why the red pill space is fit failing. First part about that I want to talk about is the weaponization of accountability. The, now, the weaponization of accountability has been uh, something that's really should be talked about because it ruins the integrity of the red pill space. No one wants to talk about it, but the reality is, is that red pillars, the fanboys, the content creators themselves spew on, on and on about a woman, a woman being accountable for what she looks like, if she has kids, if she size or just anything and nine times out of ten you're trying to hold women accountable for something that they probably have no part of or probably something they don't even have control of you don't know these people you don't know what they've been through you don't know what they're going through and yes everybody likes to say the world doesn't owe you understanding and i get that i'm tr trust me i'm one of the firm believers of that but when you try to use that as a weapon to hurt somebody to try to bring them down instead of saying hey this is happening because of this you have to you don't and if you know their story and you say hey well maybe you can try to make improvements in your life that could be something helpful but it turns into no i'm holding you accountable for something that happened in your past because let's be honest a lot of men they'll say they take accountability but what do you take accountable for what do you take it for do you take accountability for the fact that you maybe don't wash your ass? Maybe you don't brush your teeth. Maybe you're just not funny. Maybe you're just lame. Maybe you have no charisma. Maybe you just wasn't attractable to that person. Or maybe you just don't realize that there are plenty of fish in the sea and you just take that out onto all 20 women that you've ever tried to get with. The reality is, is that accountability should not be weaponized. It shouldn't even really be used in the context of trying to make dating life better. The thing is, is that there are billions of us on this planet. We all share this little ball of rock and water together and trying to weaponize accountability to try to bring down Western women does not help the initial cause. What would actually help the initial cause instead of weaponized accountability, maybe, just maybe, trying to improve yourself so that when you run across a woman that you don't, that you're not into, you can just sweep her to the side and you know go to somebody that you deem desirable it's not not that hard i'm not trying to make any um bashes at any women or anything like that but i'm just saying that accountability shouldn't be weaponized for your own failures at dating and not trying to say anything bad to the guys either but what i'm saying is, is that you know if you're going to be calling yourself being part of the red pill space you shouldn't try to use accountability as your way of saying that a woman has messed up in her life and that she doesn't deserve to pursue what she wants. Now, if a woman has ridiculous standards, so the fuck what? If you can't meet it, move along. Cause trust me, I can tell you right now, I've met plenty of women who came up with some ridiculous things that I that they said I had to do, and I thought if I, I thought it was so ridiculous and there was no compromise, I just moved on. It's not that hard. And it's not as bad as people well, want to believe it is. I don't need to get on the internet and say, well, modern women is this, that, and the third. I just say, you know what? Cool. I will go in another direction. I will search better endeavors or different endeavors. And good luck to you. That's just my piece on the accountability portion today. I know I'm going to make these videos as short as possible for all of my low attention span followers out there. Because trust me, I got one too. That being said, let me know what y'all think. Hit me in the comment section and I'll try to respond to them as, as uh, best as I can. And as I always like to say, everybody, kindness is free and I'm cheap as fuck. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And as always, stay mad, my hatters.